I interpreted it as actually playing the trumpet. Oh, uh, well, I'm a pervert, I guess. I don't know. It happens. I just, like, I don't know, I just figured that if you're going to say, you know, like, um... But when said, I did learn how to play, the only thing I could play was Iron Man on the trumpet. Are you fucking serious? Swear to God. Wow, dude, that's crazy. Iron like Man Christ on the trumpet. Still play right now. Like, Jesus, dude. Mm-hmm. That was a shit. I mean, that's... that's I didn't like, learn any of the songs that I was required to play, but I learned Iron Man. That's a hidden talent right there, man. It was I mean, awesome. it's, it's better than saying that you have exciting bowels. You can play Iron Man on right? a trumpet, you know? Like, seriously. It's oh, fucking yeah. awesome. Well, so, I mean, you know, it's better than going in a room with a pink shirt screaming, Hey, guys, I like it in the ass. Have you ever thought about doing that, Sebastian? Let's get down to your deep, no. dark... Unfortunately not. Well, that's too bad. Brian, I think, has had dreams of that more than once. I would not doubt it. Yeah. I don't know. We have to question. That's. There's a question for him. For sure. Have you ever questioned your sexuality there, Brian? (laughs) I can't admit it. Yeah, he's in boot camp. I, you know, naked guys. seriously, it's funny because, okay, like, my question for a lot of people is, is, um, how long do you think a guy, and Brian's here right now, he was asking that same question in a second. Good uh, momento. Like, okay, how long do you think a guy can go without, you know, having sex, jerking off, and that kind of thing, being in that kind of environment? Hold on a second. Okay, so we're sitting here with, uh, oh, actually, yeah, would you state your name for the camera, please? I'm Brian Frazier. I'm 19, and I'm a fucking pimp. The one, the only. We, uh, just got done, I say we, me and the camera. The camera's an entity in itself. Yes. Yeah, we just got done interviewing your, uh, friend and roommate. It's nice to see you again. There he is. He didn't go very far. I promise you, audience. Do you hear that dog barking? Yes. Okay, because I thought I was losing my fucking mind there for a second. Holy shit. Are you not supposed to swear at interviews? It's my fucking interview, Mr. Fraser. so fair. I will do any way I want to fucking do it. Alright. Bitch. Anyway, so, um, so you're 19, huh? Yes, ma'am. Do you like being 19? As it's perks. So where do you work? Subway. What do you do at Subway? I make subs and clean and work with customers. I think I have pretty good conversation skills. Have you... <laughs> What's so funny? I'm not laughing, so... Uh, anyway, uh, have you ever, like, uh, had an incident with a customer where they were being just outright rude and... Yes, ma'am, all the time. And have you ever just wanted to fucking throw their sub right back at their face? No, usually I just want to jump over the counter and stab them with my knife. That's besides you have that. knives at Subway? How do you think they cut the subs? Yeah, but not with sharp, like, oh, I thought fuck, maybe yeah. like serrated Brandon, knives or Brandon something. Brandon cut the fucking tip of his finger out. Oh, yeah, way, way sharp knives. Like, you don't even know. These things are sharp. Like, you go like that, like, and just fucking like, go deep as shit with no issue. See, working in the food industry, especially, like, at Subway or something, I, I find that difficult, I mean, just dealing with customers on a daily basis, but you seem to be, like, a... You consider yourself a people person? Yes, ma'am. Like, you have a kind of a friendly personality? Yes, ma'am. Oh, <laughs> shit. Again, that was, uh, Sebastian over there. He's got a pipe in every two seconds. Thank you, Sebastian. Yeah, well, Sebastian, he doesn't really have <coughs> skills and... He is, he's not very, he is not very professional. Because yeah, when you're working, you know, you got you can't act like you do on the streets, and you have and to act professional with people. So. Well, do you feel like a badass because you work at Subway? No, ma'am. Really? You're a subinator, man. Um, yes. You can't pick up chicks by saying, Hi, I'm Brian Frazier. I'm a subinator. No. Want to take it in the ass? A little, little better than the Shermanator, but whatever. Wow. Jeez, Brian. At least I'm like a shiminator. I'm not a virgin. 
you well, hear I'll... that camera? He has his butt cherry <laughs> <in> the pot. <coughs> I'm like, oh my god. <clears throat> Sorry, I was giving a blowjob back here while I was trying to interview these guys. <clears throat> yes, it uh, looks like you need to clean that shit out of your throat. I know, it's a little difficult blowing somebody and trying to talk at the same time. Yes, it's very disturbing watching that while I've had taken an interview. Are you, uh, scarred for life? Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry, I'll do my best just not to scar you again, but... <clears throat> so you're, you're not originally from Kalkaska then, right? No, ma'am. Where are you from? I'm from Burton. Burton, Burton Michigan. Michigan. You know, the pussy-ass suburb of the bigger city, Flint. Yes, ma'am. Do you wish you were from Flint? Do you, like, have you ever told anyone you're from Flint, not Burton? I always did. I mean, it's like an intersection way. I mean, when you say Burton, people are like, what's that? I might as well just say Flint, because it's... Right there. I was well, do you think it's acceptable for someone, say, from, like, Davison to say they're from Flint? No. That's it's what Michael Moore does. He's not really from Flint. He's from Davison. Did you know that? No, I didn't. Graduated from Davison High School, yeah. And Davison's a little rich town anyways. It is. Burton, yeah. well, where I lived, was just... Right Burton's like in between the, the shithole and the Richie area, so yeah. it's kind of like in between. It's a little mixture of shit and Ritz. Yes. Uh, for everyone that can't hear it back there, Sebastian is getting some cheese. He's going to cut the cheese, everybody. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, you're a skateboarder then too, right? I try. Do you, uh... I, I asked Sebastian this, I mean, like, he... I asked him, because he, he tends to be really into music and stuff, but, you know, like, you really like skateboarding. Have you ever had aspirations to, like, become, like, an amateur professional skateboarder? I wish I could. I'd like to try, but definitely need to practice a lot more and learn how to do a lot more. And do you kind of feel insecure when you skateboard? Not at all. I do. And that was Sebastian eating cheese. That's saying Sebastian's. I do. He's just a douche. So do you, uh... You think Sebastian's really emo? No comment. Good answer.